we are gonna head on over to the worst rated hair salon i think i might regret that decision later i feel like this side is shorter than this side hi guys i'm mar no i'm not crazy i swear this has an explanation but today i'm gonna be going to the worst rated hair salon and i yeah this is happening all right you guys so this hair salon it has so many one star reviews it's like i'm not even kidding and they're pretty recent so i'm gonna read some of those awful one star reviews okay so sack says one star horrible service i called to make an appointment and she said come in 15 minutes i showed up in 15 minutes she asked if i could come back in 40 minutes because somebody just showed up what's the point of making an appointment then she laughed horrible service i will never go there again or we'll recommend to anybody okay here's another review one star it says please know there are two yellow pages for this salon oh you already know when there's two yellow pages you know that's about to be a mess it's like they start a yelp and then they're an awful place and they get really bad reviews so they start another one they never fix their mistakes it's like of course both yelps are gonna be bad you know these all shady businesses do the same thing i don't know why so everybody in the reviews is complaining about this person Sun and when I went in there I asked about Sun and she wasn't there so I honestly feel that the reason why this salon has so many bad reviews is because of Sun because every bad review is about Sun and when I went in I asked and the girl that was with me was not Sun and the other person was not Sun either just so I don't know I mean if I would have gotten Sun just so you guys know but look it says unfortunately I can't recommend Sun was nice enough I guess but what other reviewers have pointed out about this place is true. I came in wanting my grace covered by my natural hair color, chocolate brown. What I got was just shy of black, all the way to the ends of my long hair. Looks like shoe polish. There was virtually no discussion or input from me. Sun just picked a color. Okay, so she just decided your hair about to be black right now. I don't care if you have dark brown, dark brown, black, the same to me, okay, girl? What? Look at this review, one star. I called ahead and asked if they had time for a cut and color and described what I wanted. It. No problem. I drove all the way out here and they waffled and said what I wanted sounded too complicated. What? And to go somewhere else as they didn't have time. Thanks for wasting two hours of my commute time. Two, okay, why would you drive to this place two hours away? I mean, who drives to a hair salon that's two hours away? It would have to be like the most amazing. Like, it'll be like, you know, this person that's been doing your hair forever and they moved away and you're like, okay, you know what? I'm driving two hours, but who drives two hours for a hair salon? Oh, look, this is what I was saying. So Susan, one star, said, I went to this family. Saturday to have my hair washed and trimmed. I had a wonderful experience with Karina and she was understanding and gentle. Because I was unable to wash my own hair due to surgery, I went back to have my hair washed. <laughs> I mean, I love that she's explaining why she goes back to the salon to have her hair washed. It's not like, oh, well, I just had a good experience. I'm going back. She's like, it's because I can't do it myself. Then I got the most rude beautician named Sun. So it's the Sun, the problem. Oh, oh my God. It feels like a celebrity to me. I'm like, I need to meet the Sun. She wanted to charge me more for everything because all I needed was a wash and a ponytail. <gasps> no. No. When I told Sun no blow dry, she began to berate me and that said, I will sue you, claiming that I was abusing her. She told me $25 charge, but wrote $20 in the ledger, so I only paid $20. When I demanded a receipt and her name, Sun told me she was the manager. Then she said she was the owner. Neither was true. Steer clear of this salon. Oh my god. That's crazy. Okay, that's hella crazy. Okay, so here I found the mandatory fake five-star review because there's always fake five-star reviews. Every time I see one of these, look, it says, Sun is fabulous. She does the best color in LA. Always kind and quick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. I don't believe you, Tanya, whoever you are. Mm -mm. So Terry, one star, says, Worst, never again. If the owner wants to respond to me and give me a phone number and time to call them, I will definitely. I'll rather tell the person who can actually do something about this horrible salon rather than complain on the site. Thank you. I mean, I get your point. Honestly, I do. But I, nobody responded to them. All right, you guys. So I went to the salon and this was my experience. All right, you guys, so we are gonna head on over to the worst rated hair salon. I am gonna ask for curls. Well, I'm gonna get like wash my hair and everything. All of my hair is clean right now. But I feel like curls is something that's kind of like complicated enough, but also like easy enough because any hairstylist should be easy to do a curl. But my hair doesn't really hold a curl too well. As you can see, it's like pretty, I don't know, 
just like flat so we're gonna do that oh you know what i just thought of this i'm gonna ask her to give me like maybe some layers to the front of my face oh god i'm gonna do that i think i might regret that decision later but just like some really you know long layers to the front of my face <laughs> and see what happens i mean i did cut my own hair so if she does a worse job than i did when i cut my own hair then i don't even know what to tell you guys but yeah so we'll see this is what my hair looks like right now it's pretty basic just like my black hair <laughs> and yeah let's go let's see what happens we're getting close guys i'm scared for my hair gordo i'm gonna ask for a, like a small haircut oh god gordo must be yeah i'm you're probably terrified because he does not want me to like ever cut my hair but it's only gonna be a little bit i mean if they abuse the scissors i don't know what might happen <laughs> but just a little we'll see okay it's that place oh yes all right we're going in you guys Yeah. Okay. Alright guys, I'm in the chair. About to get new hairdo. Okay, so how much do you want to cut? Do you know? Um, I just want to like frame my face a little bit because okay. you know like this is like very long I feel like it's not really framing my face. Okay. So just this that is like a bit. Okay, so. Also, I don't know if you noticed. Yeah. No, I just, this is fine. It's just around my face. Just frame the face. Mm -hmm. And not cut the back? No, not the back. Not the back. I'll just cut the front. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to take off, take this one off, or are you freezing? I'm cold. So okay. you, do you need it off? No, you're, you're okay. We're just going to frame the face, right? Yeah. Are you going anywhere special? Um, I'm going to Korea. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It's pricey. It's pricey. A bit dry, so that doesn't matter. Yeah. Me. No, I just wanted to do my face because I like that color that's like light. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if you've seen. Yeah, yeah, my ends are a mess. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I think this is the first time I've gotten my hair cut with my hair dry. Mm -hmm. Well, because this way I can see the shape. You can see it better, yeah. Mm -hmm. It makes sense. Mm -hmm. makes sense. But everybody's different, you yeah. know. I, I'm not gonna say one way is right. It all depends on the, uh, you know, individual. Yeah, I feel like that makes sense. So how sure do you want me to have the layer? Like you want? Um, well, yeah, I can't actually. really see. <laughs> okay, actually, yeah, I'll do it for you. Yeah. yeah, I forgot to ask how much this would be. Oh, the cost will be because your hair, your hair is long. Yeah. Okay, blow dry forty. Yeah. And the haircut twenty five, sixty five. Oh, okay, yeah. Sixty five plus and curl, right? Oh, plus the curl. Yes. Oh, okay. So how much is the curl? Actually, the blow dry will be forty five. Thirty dollars, hundred okay. together. Oh, a hundred! Wow, it's extra for the curl. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Okay. Okay. What's your name? My name is. What is your name? Mar. What is it? Mar. Mar. Oh, okay. Are you guys on like an, you know, acting or music or? Oh no, I just make daily videos of my life. Oh, like okay. On YouTube and stuff. Sure. Yeah. Oh, so you're a YouTuber? Yeah. Oh, okay. So more on this or? I can do a little bit more on the front. Um, okay. I think it looks fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Since that's not just to frame the face. Okay, yeah. I'm not gonna charge you for the full haircut. Full haircut trim is 25. So let's see. 40, 45. Okay, it's gonna be 85 altogether. Haircut. Oh, thank you. Thing, Ten dollars. Yeah. 90 altogether. Oh, okay. okay. All right. Is it better? Y yeah. Thank yeah. you. Good. Do you want to get your hair done too? <laughs> Look how good. It looks so good just like that. Yeah. But I really want to curl it. Final result. 
Oh, I feel like we're here forever. My hair is so long. Mm -hmm. No, I didn't realize your hair was so long. Yeah. I really like it. It looks really good. Yeah, it looks really good. You have beautiful hair, like I said. And I like the, the volume. The lighter on the ends. And we have a little string. I mean, you are, you look young. You look like a high school student. You think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. you have a young face. So are you want, do you want me to spray now? Or you yeah. you want to spray, spray some more? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, you do whatever you feel you need to. Are you gonna fix it later? Or? Uh, no, you, you do mm -hmm. whatever. Okay. okay. Spray me. Okay, let me trust my. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I, I feel like I've already, like. Uh, you know. like yeah, we don't do so, like, tight anymore. Okay, I'm, like, trying to, like. Already? Okay, I was like, I don't wanna, like. <laughs> Finish result. Mm -hmm. Thank you, you like so it? much. Yes, I will. Really Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Oh, you guys look adorable. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Okay. Bye. Nice Bye. meeting you. Nice meeting you too. All right, you guys, we're out. Thank God. I feel my throat hurts from all the hairspray <laughs> I drank, inhaled. I don't even know. I think it was like basically just drinking it. But honestly, I would not give it a one star. No. She was so nice. I mean, there's like some loose strands of hair that she didn't curl. There's some around there that are not curled. But I think she did a great job, honestly. It did take her forever. We were in there for a good two hours, my hair. It's never taken that long to get my hair done. But I don't know. She was very, very nice, honestly. She was a very sweet lady. Oh, here. Here's the strand of hair. Here it is. Here's one of them. It's still basically straight. But okay, not one star though. Honestly, my issue is that this place was pretty expensive. I mean, the regular place I go to to get like this hairstyle, I pay 55, which is like a hair salon. And it's like, I don't know, it's nicer. And this was more expensive. And it's not that she did a bad job, but I feel that she's not like, I don't know how to explain it. I feel like she's not as experienced doing hair. I feel like she mostly just does like men's haircut from the people that walked into the place. So if it would have been like hella cheap, I'll be like, yes, but overall, I loved her. She was super, super, super nice. So, I don't know. I just kind of wish this place was cheaper. But let's see. Let's see how this holds up. Let's see if it falls. Maybe it'll be like amazing and it'll hold forever. Who knows? Okay, you guys. So, it's time to show up my hair. Wait. Oh, God. I feel like this is like a... <sighs> before and after moment. Well, you guys already saw my hair, honestly. So, here it is. Ta-da! All right, guys, so I know you already saw most of it, but there's a couple of things you didn't see. And first of all, what I found strange, I know I said that it was like expensive, but I found it so strange how they didn't like have a price for anything. She like said a hundred and then she was like, oh, well, cause I complained about it. I was like, well, that seems like really expensive. And then she was like, well, okay. 90 and she was like well 80 well no never mind 85 you know she like kind of just like set whatever price she wanted and i know somebody said that they would tell you a price and then they would put something else down but i don't know what she put down i didn't really check so i don't know if she put down like 50 i have no idea son like i said was not there the girl that was with me was sarah and honestly she was so nice i mean well I'll talk about the hairstyle in a minute but she was nice like her you know when somebody's like really nice to you even if they're doing like kind of like a crappy job you're just like oh, you're so sweet it's been i don't know maybe how long has it been like five hours so it has fallen i did not brush it out this is what it ended up looking like i'm fine with it i mean i think she did a pretty good job it did take her a really long time but honestly i would not say this is like the worst hair salon as far as my haircut goes she okay so i feel like this side is shorter than this side i don't know is it just me what do you guys think i feel like she did leave it a little bit shorter i didn't eat oh yeah oh my god oh my god it's for sure like a lot shorter there's no strand of hair that's this oh my god okay i mean oh god do you guys see right here and then right oh my god look at the difference this is a lot short like look this is here and then this is all the way down here ah i don't know i mean it was it's kind of hard because she was so nice i was like, expecting somebody who would be terrible i mean i would never go back there again because she's just not a good stylist and it's not like the manicure place where i was like ah oh, at least it was cheap but i'm gonna pass this one on to you guys you guys <laughs> let me know what your thoughts are i mean i'm not a professional hairstylist so i don't know what she was doing with like right or wrong i do get my hair done often enough where i felt like she was pulling on my hair a lot i mean i was like in pain and then with the hairspray my throat hurt from so much hairspray that i ingested at that salon so that was pretty bad but yeah let me know what you guys think don't forget i've made a whole bunch of these i went to the worst rated makeup artist which was crazy i feel like i need to go to another makeup artist just because that time i didn't even get my makeup done i went to the worst rated all you can eat i went to the worst rated restaurant i've even gone to the worst rated plastic surgeon and that video is 
is coming up on Friday. So make sure you guys check back on Friday to see that because that was an experience. But yeah, you guys also don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe by clicking down there. Also tap that little notification bell to join Club Mar. I post new videos every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday. So you definitely will subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the new video awesomeness. But you guys, thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. I will leave another cool video right here for you guys to go check out now that you finished watching this one. And you guys, I'll see you in the next one.